excitement of Plus, an Indian. Absolutely excited. Um, 19th of August, it launches here, it releases here. We worked really, really hard and we just really hope that people enjoy it. Uh, we've enjoyed making the film, we've had a lot of fun doing it. It's got a nice message in the film too. Yeah, I think, you know, it's released, uh, you know, in other parts of the world and really excited to see the film release in India and, uh, you know, see what the reaction of the Indian audience is and hopefully it's embraced by the Indian audience as much as it has been embraced in the rest of the world. I like the fact that uh, it's an Australian movie. Um, it talks about and goes through about different cultures, you know, whether you're Indian, whether you're Australian, how love has no boundaries and... I think that that's how life should be. You know, if you if you want to fall in love with someone, um, doesn't matter where they come from, you should be able to do that. No, not really. It was more so opportunity, and I want to really take that opportunity. I love trying new things in life, and I really, really want to make sure that we give this a red hot go. We we worked hard for three months. There's a lot of preparation, um, a lot of effort going into this film, but we just really hope people enjoy our film. I think we always put people into slots and, you know, categories and I think that doesn't exist in life. You know, a lot of times people ask me, you do this kind of cinema and why don't you do that kind of cinema? Uh, it's the same thing that, you know, Brett is Brett Lee. So he had an innings in his life where he was a cricketer and now... He's an actor. Now, I would like to talk about him only as an actor and because I've met Brett Lee as an actor. <laughs> so, um, he's a, he's an, I think he's just a natural on, on camera and I really had a wonderful time working with him. Um, I think it's a very universal story like uh, what Brett said. It's a love story and uh, in a very globalized world that we live, all these big global cities have a very multicultural existence where people from different kinds of countries, different countries, different languages, different cultures come and live together. <clears throat> and there is a unity in that and Unindian celebrates that unity through a love story between Will and Mira. And um, in, in a world today where there's so much violence, I think it's high time that we celebrate the unity in that diversity. And uh, I think that is what uh, is the flavor of an Indian, uh, an Australian film with Indian spices. It's lighthearted and yet uh, it's quite layered. So I think the audience would really enjoy it. Oh, you always... You know, you always appreciate what they do, but look, I guess the advice I got was to to be natural and to be yourself. You know, I'm not out. It's like bowling. I don't want to go and copy someone else's action. I want to make my own action, and then hopefully people copy your action. So I just try to be as natural as possible. I really try to create my character will and try to go and and delve down deeper into, I guess, him as a person and what his background is and where he was born. So we we. We dreamt up this whole um, life story about Will Henderson and that certainly helped when he got the chance to meet his um, beautiful girl. Um, well, not anything probably different is I'm wearing a blue jacket. I'm still in my whites. <laughs> so pretty, pretty similar. <laughs> I think that's a question that Brett would... Brett is very popular. <laughs> yeah. uh, he would answer because he's Australian. I don't know whether it's true in Australia. If you want to be popular, you have to become a cricketer or or an actor. Is that true in Australia as well? Or maybe um, or a politician. Yeah, or that's true in Indian as well. TV. India as well. Yeah. Like, or a politician, yeah. Or a journalist. <laughs> <laughs> because cricket is the most popular sport in India, I guess. Um, in Australia, there are other sports people who are mm. equally famous. We went and met your friend um, a soccer player. Tim Cahill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there are other sports and sports people who are Adam quite Gilchrist. famous. <laughs> you know what, though? It's, yeah. Everyone's different. Not everyone yeah. wants to be... I, I wasn't out there to play cricket to be popular. Yeah. I play cricket because I love the sport. And some people enjoy the popularity. Some people enjoy the limelight. Some people enjoy the cameras. Other people don't. And yeah. that's the thing, I think, in life that... When you play sport, people assume you, you're the, the best role model. They assume that you want to be popular. Mm. Now, I enjoy being a role model for children. Yes, that's, but a lot of people don't. 
Yeah. And that's that's up to them. I think that's where I absolutely connect to Brett as a person as well that you know even actors all actors don't become actors because they just want to have the limelight because mm. acting as a process mm. you would also understand is it's a very intimate and a and a process of self discovery which people enjoy as artists mm. and I'm an actor because of that. Tora tora I'm Keso. No stay. <laughs> yeah, see, it's it's getting very late now, so Jody Cutter, we need some tandapani. <laughs> Everything. I love. You know, it's it's the culture, the people, the the food, um, the questions that you get when you're doing media conferences. That's fun. It's exciting. <laughs> done, last, done, last, done, done. last message. I always enjoy one more question. Only one more question means you got <laughs> ten more. <laughs> Message to an audience. I never want to be on a higher moral ground giving messages to anyone. Just yeah, yeah. The, I mean, that's not a message. It's like a request, request. that please uh, <laughs> watch uh, our film, An Indian, which is releasing in the theaters in India um, on the 19th of August. Uh, uh, it's been received very well in various other parts mm. of the world, and um, hopefully, you know, you'll enjoy the film. Yeah, look, I think that they will enjoy 106 minutes where there's no violence and, and no swearing. Um, come on the journey with, I guess, Will and, and Mira when they go down the, the sort of rocky road of, uh, of love and romance and all the things that go with it. So hopefully they enjoy it. And if you enjoy it, fantastic. Tell all your mates if they don't enjoy it.